what opening does this vessel right here pass through to gain access to the cranium? Now, if you want more questions like this, comment anatomy down below and we'll send you a message. So starting off first, what are we looking at? Well, we're looking at the floor of the cranial vault. We've removed the brain and we've exposed a few of the spinal nerves. Let's zoom on in, get a better look at this region. So you can see right here, this is gonna be cranial nerve one, the olfactory nerve. We have cranial nerve two, which is gonna be our optic nerve. And we have cranial nerve three right here, which is gonna be our ocular motor nerve. We also have this vessel that just emerges on either side of our cella turcica. Now, just lateral to the cella turcica, that's where we would have our cavernous sinus. And that's where this vessel is emerging from. So what opening does this vessel, which is going to be our internal carotid artery, pass through to get access to the cranium? Well, it's going to enter through the carotid canal somewhere over here and then travels medially and it passes above the foramen lacerum, which has that cartilaginous membrane and it travels superiorly through that cavernous sinus to gain access to the cranium. And from there, it divides into the middle cerebral artery as well as the anterior cerebral artery and it joins with that posterior connecting artery. So the correct answer in this case is gonna be the carotid canal.